So in this particular video, I will be telling you about how can you maximize your score in chemistry and some high weightage topics that you can get to see in the exam papers this year. So before we start this video, let me tell you guys an important thing. We are introducing a new batch for our class 11 students, which is early adroit 11th J mains and advanced 2023 batch by Unacademy India's largest online learning platform. In this program, you will be mentored by four of the best faculties in their subjects and the batch starts from 5th of February. You will be mentored by Om Sharma sir who is an IIT Bombay graduate plus 13 years teaching experience in maths in Kota and ex-research fellow at BARC. Mohammad Kashiv Alam sir, researcher, science guy, teaching J Advanced, Mains, Gate and PSUs qualified. Pankat Singh sir, 10 plus years of experience in IIT JEE training, mentored many ranks under AIR 500, worked with Fidji, Akash, CP Kota, Narayana, Super China Batch. And last but not the least, Suresh Dwivedi sir, MSc gold medalist, 25 years teaching experience for IITJ, mentor of IITJ AIR1, taught IITJ AIR1, 7, 18 and a lot more. So here is a plus subscription description where you can choose the best program for you and here is a catch. Apply the promo code ARCJEE while you are proceeding to pay and you get an exciting discount of 10%. So now let's begin with the video. Chemistry for most students, it is either a nightmare or a daydream. But here is the catch. What if I tell you that you can score the most in this subject by studying just in these last months? So, chemistry is easy, but seeing the number of papers being set, it's almost impossible to predict the individual weightage of a particular chapter. Still, I'm listing the way with which you can score maximum and well in the subject. Inorganic. For this, you need to do class 12th NCRT really well. The most of the questions asked from inorganic are mostly theoretical and some of the, cal some of the questions need a bit of calculation. First important chapter is complex compounds. Another is DNF block. DNF block is comparatively easy and mostly theoretical but you will always get one question at least in the exam paper. Qualitative analysis. In the present days, you can get a question from this chapter in the exam paper. Earlier, it wasn't that much asked. Now, if you haven't started with class 11th preparation or you have missed your class 11th or you haven't prepared your class 11th well, please do at least these topics and chapters well so that you get a decent score. Chemical bonding. A very consistent and good number of questions plus involved in all other chapters. The topics I'm telling, make sure you do these well for the exam. The first is molecular orbital theory. The second is Fazan's rule. Third one, shape and hybridization, bond length and angles, Benz rule, Drago's rule and most importantly, all the exceptions in on inorganic chemistry so that if you get a sub part from these chapters in any of the questions, you are able to do them well. Now, one more chapter which has at least one question in the paper is periodic properties. It's easy plus a guaranteed question you can expect. Now block chemistry, S block and P block, they are very much asked questions, very much asked chapters, make sure you do them well. Coming to organic chemistry. For organic, you have to mug up class 12th NCRT, the preparation methods of compounds, chemical reactions, name reactions, reagents, everything very well. With class 11th, just be prepared with the basics that is IUPAC, nomenclature, isomerisms and GOC because direct questions might not be there but you can expect a sub part of, to, uh, from these chapters in most of the questions. In most of the questions, there's a last part like tell the number of isomers, 
लाइक टेल द ओनली जोमेट्रिकल आइसोमर्स द ओनली ऑप्टिकल आइसोमर्स सो यू हैव टू टेल दैट सो दीज क्वेश्चन और दीज चैप्टर्स बिकम द मस्ट टू पार्ट ऑफ द पेपर कमिंग टू फिजिकल केमिस्ट्री फिजिकल कैन सीम ईजियर टू मोस्ट ऑफ यू बट इट हैज़ अ बैलेंस अमाउंट ऑफ क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम बोथ द इलेवेंथ एंड ट्वेल्थ पोर्शन सो इफ यू आर समन विद वीक क्लास इलेवेंथ मेक श्योर यू स्टडी अ लिटल बिट एंड यू विल बी एबल टू डू फिजिकल वेल I am listing some of the chapters which have at least one question every year from both of these 11th and 12th syllabus. First is mole concept. At least one question every year plus the most basic chapter that is used in every other chapter. So you should have a good grip on this one. Mole concept is included with electrochemistry as well. You can see it in chemical kinetics as well, in solutions as well. So okay, mole concept is the base. coming to equilibrium either chemical or ionic you can expect one question from this chapter as well thermodynamics and thermochemistry solid state chemical kinetics electrochemistry solutions surface surface chemistry surface chemistry is mostly theoretical again and it is very scoring now coming to the last portion and which is easy yet scoring it is environmental chemistry biomolecules chemistry in everyday life one to two questions from this section so you can't miss this section at all make sure you do it very well and mostly it's theory so you can expect a direct question from this one okay Hush.